Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Thursday, 12th of October 2023. These trades were shared by Yasin who is trading S&P 500 futures. If you look at the 5 minute macro chart, we see that the price is in downtrend and you can see the downtrend channel here clearly. So using 1 minute structural chart, you can see the downtrend channel with good momentum. So using 500 tick chart as a trading chart, he identified a sell short position based on algo 1 to 5 and entered and managed this with profit. Again, when the price reached this area of static support and the buyers came back, he identified this as a very low risk area and entered two long positions and managed and exit this with exit the strategy number 2 with profit. So thank you Yasin for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Yan or Global Instructor who is trading gold USD in form of CFD here. As you see the macro chart shows that the price broke the dynamic support area and the downtrend channel can be seen in the structural chart. So this downtrend channel with good momentum was seen in the trading chart as well and using the algo 1 to 5 when the pullback got completed he entered one sell short position and managed an exit this with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you Jan for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to a student yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the trades that I have taken today on Thursday, 12th of October 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ, Dow Jones and S&P 500. If you look at the one hour macro chart, we see that the price was fluctuating around the previous day close and high on all eminis during the Asian session and it started to go up during London session. Then during the New York market session, if we look at the 10 minute macro chart, we see that the price was already in this low level on NASDAQ and others was testing the previous day close and retested this level few times on NASDAQ and around 10 o'clock the buyers came back strongly on all E-minis so that's the reason I took long positions on NASDAQ and Dow Jones and S&P 500 and all these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts and we see that the result was positive showing profit factor of 1.84 with 76% win rate from the long positions taken and average win to loss ratio about 0.6 the largest winning trade was 310 and the largest losing trade was $539. So hope this trade is taken by the PATH system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.